Good day, Upper Peninsula. We have some exciting news from the world of space exploration. A company based in Marquette called Cal Morris Incorporated just hit a major milestone with their new tech on the International Space Station. KMI launched this robotic device called Reach, and it's already completed two successful missions. The innovative gadget has multiple arms and is designed to grab and release space junk like defunct satellites. Recent tests show it can successfully catch floating objects in low gravity. So uh, this is all part of what we're figuring out today. Looking good. That was better? That was beautiful. This is an amazing shot we have here in the camera. This is just wonderful. KMI is on a mission to help clean up outer space and make it safer and more sustainable. The team behind Reach believes that these tests will not just help their own technology, but the whole space community tackle the issue of space debris. But we and many experts believe that the most expensive way to solve space debris is to do nothing right now. When a satellite is orbiting the Earth and its systems die, whether the computer stops working or the battery runs out, it doesn't just stop existing. The satellite is still up there, and because of orbital mechanics, it will stay up there for essentially forever. When the next major debris collision occurs, it's going to be a big problem. And everybody's thinking, yeah, but we'll worry about that when it happens. And we're thinking, how about we figure it out now before it happens, and maybe we can even go so far as to prevent it. Austin Morris, KMI's co-founder, shared how proud he is of the team and what they've accomplished. He said in a recent press release, quote, this demonstration showcases not only the capabilities of reach, but the capabilities of the KMI team as well. I am immensely proud of the quality of technology demonstration displayed and extremely grateful to the many partners who helped bring the project to fruition. <laughs> there we go, Sonny. As of today, January 30th, the REACH technology has been in space for 83 days. And there's more to come. KMI has even more operations planned aboard the space station in the next few months to explore what REACH can really do. We'll keep you updated as youpers continue to reach for the stars. For my UP News, I'm Andrew Lawrencer.